It's a new day and a new year, but Korea's parliament remains in a deadlock over old bills. Following a series of failed talks between the rival parties on how to redraw Korea's electoral map, the Speaker of the National Assembly had no choice but to submit a constituency draft late last night. The current electoral district system has now been declared invalid in line with a 2014 constitutional court ruling. Arirang News Parliamentary Correspondent Chi Myung-gil reports. Assembly Speaker Chang Yu-ha called the current situation a legislative emergency and asked the National Election Commission's redistricting committee to draw up a final plan. I hope the committee panel comes up with a neutral plan that doesn't take into account political interests. Chang's draft is likely to conform to the current system, allocating 246 seats to local constituencies and 54 to proportional representatives. Until now, the two parties have agreed to increase the number of elected seats by 7 to 253, thereby reducing the number of proportional seats to 47. However, both sides remain deadlocked over the details of the proportional representation system. On Friday, rival parties had mixed reactions to Chang's decision. It was his only choice after Friday midnight. You should ask the assembly speaker later on. But there still is a chance that the parties may reach a last-minute agreement in an effort to maximize the number of local candidates within the House. In 2014, the Constitutional Court ruled that the current electoral map was unconstitutional and must be corrected. Chung plans to exercise his authority to directly table the new constituency bill at a plenary session slated for next Friday. Chim Young-gil, Arirang News.